What's up, YouTube? Two weeks out. So today is, what's today's date? Do you know? Today is the 2nd. Okay. September 2nd. Two weeks out. So this is me. When I actually wake up. Before I look alive. And I tanned last night, so I'm all tanned. It's the last time I'm tanning before the show because I'm going to scrub this off at the end of the week and then give my skin a break and prepare my skin for the spray tan. That's what I'm doing. And then I have to shave him. Oh, That'll yeah. be fun. Oh, fucking good. It's the morning now. Oh, well, no one wants to show him everything. <laughs> anyway. So at least something's missed. I'm making my breakfast. We got eggs. And oats. And then I gotta take my vitamins, which I take these every day. The Alani New Balance. I've taken these since. For how long? I think this is my fifth bottle. Um, I take vitamin C, activated charcoal, CLA. Um, 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 and fish oil. Which we need more. Oh yeah, which we need more. What is, is this empty? I think it was like, I think it was like more now. But why it's still in the freezer? It's empty. Yeah, fun fact, or a tip, if you put your fish oil in the freezer, you don't get fish burps. Oh, it lasts longer. And it lasts longer. And it lasts longer. Quicker to digest. Anyway, I'm gonna go eat my breakfast, look alive, and today I have to get the pink and blue out of my extensions for the show. I have to do that. I'm dyeing my hair next week so it's all fresh. And we're almost at peak week, y'all. I'll be back in. Alright, y'all, I'm back. Got myself all ready. Um, it is 12.45, I have to cook my meal, um, I ate my breakfast about two and a half hours ago, so I gotta cook and eat that, um, I'm just gonna show you what I'm eating, I guess, um, so I am eating tilapia, asparagus, and rice. Okay, so I've got my tilapia weighed out, it is weighing in at... 5.15 ounces. Um, I usually eat 4 ounces, but my coach said if I'm hungry, eat more. So, um, my bikini prep is, I don't want to say easy because I've had some rough days the past week, but I lean out really fast. I'm not trying to like brag about that or anything. My prep was eight weeks, um, and I'm maintaining my weight. Right now I am 101 pounds, um, and I've been that for the past two weeks, but a lot of bikini girls aren't like that. I don't know, my metabolism's really high, I lean out really fast. I don't know why, but I'm okay with it. Um, I still have carbs. Two weeks out, still have carbs, still got a gallon of water. As I almost missed my mouth. Um, yeah, so that is what my first meal is. And then I have my jasmine rice, and I have half a cup. Uh, yeah, so I do two 
meals with half a cup, two meals with a quarter cup. And then my last meal, I just have a little bit of sweet potato um, and another piece of tilapia if I'm really hungry at night. And then I do five pieces of asparagus, or five asparagus stalks. Um, and we just get the steamable asparagus because it's easier. Um, yeah, so that is what I'm doing right now. We use Flavor God. We are almost out of everything. Still waiting for my Flavor God to come in the mail. Which should be here in a few days. Hopefully tomorrow. Actually, hopefully today. Um, I'm waiting for my Blackstone Lab stuff to get here. Which, once that gets here, I'll talk a little bit more about that and my ambassadorship and everything. The leggings that I want to wear today are my Acta leggings. Uh, I am an ambassador for them as well, and I want to talk a little bit more about them because I love these leggings, y'all. Like, love them. Um, I'll always leave my links and codes for 15% off in the description. With Blackstone, y'all get 20% off with my code. Um, it helps out a lot because, honestly, Acta leggings are expensive, but, and I thought, before I ordered them, I thought they were a little... I thought that was a little ripoff, but then I got them in the mail, and I thought they were going to be too small. I put them on, and they molded to my legs, like, molded to my body perfectly. I mean, yeah, this is kind of becoming a rant. I got my lavender diffuser on for calming scents. It smells so good. Recommend that if you're doing bikini prep. Lavender will calm you down. Another thing, we were using olive oil, but we found this butter flavor cooking spray. It has no fats, no carbs, no sodium, literally nothing. Zero all around. We got it at Lidl. I don't know, so if you could find something like this, I recommend. Let's cook up this tilapia, because I am starving. Hey, say hi. Say hi to the vlog. Roscoe! No? Bella, you wanna say hi? Oh, you wanna say hi! <laughs> yes, Bells. Always wants attention! Always! What? So annoying. They will literally drive their golf carts in our backyard to retrieve golf balls. So you know what I do? If I see one of them walking up to get a golf ball, I run out, grab the golf ball, run back inside, close the door, lock it, and just stand there with the golf ball. Oh, ignore my tan on my hands, y'all. Just tan last night. Just stand there. Like that. Um, I just wanted to say, Marco, uh, as y'all know, he is a police officer. And he is doing this prep with 12-hour shifts. Um, on the weekends, he works 3 to 3, 3 p.m. to 3 a.m., and it's really hard for him because his last meal is at 10 o'clock. Um, so then he has to go five hours without eating um, with just, like, little healthy snacks. And he is kicking butt, I will just say. He looks amazing, and he's going to do so good at this show. And yeah, I just want to jump on here and say that. Um, Marco, I love you, and you are doing amazing. This is what they look like. I got the blue. They have these details on the side, and they say Acta. And most leggings are too long for me at the bottom, but these... Go perfectly to my ankles. So, this is what they look like. Yeah. Super, super cute. Love them. Love them. So, if you want to get some of those, the link will be in the description. Click that link and type in Barbell Bun 96 in the discount code for 15% off. I recommend the top that I'm wearing is Buff Bunny. Obviously, because what else do I wear? 
act up Buff Bunny and Jim Shark occasionally. Anyway. Alrighty, y'all. At the gym. Got my pre-workout. Do not have my Blackstone Lab stuff, so I'm using one up. And it's very chunky. So. Sorry, Scott. I know you don't like me doing this, but I'm just going to eat it. And my mom's gone. Hello, mom. All right, y'all. Just took my pre-workout. Um, let's get some shoulders done. Shoulders. All right, y'all. For shoulders, I started with lateral raises. I did two sets of 10 reps with light weight, and then I did two sets of eight reps with heavier weight, and I really focused on slow, controlled movement. Um, as you can see, I'm going really, really slow with this exercise. You really wanna focus on lifting with your shoulders and almost feeling like you have a string attached to your elbow and your elbow moves first and you can feel the burning in your shoulders. And then I moved right on to dumbbell shoulder press. I did four sets of eight to 10 reps with this, self-explanatory. And then this is also one of my favorite uh, shoulder exercise. I did front raise with the cables. I did three sets of 10 reps with this. I used the easy bar attachment. Again, slow and controlled movements focusing on lifting with your shoulders, not your biceps. That's really important for the front cable raise. And then I did lying overhead raise with the rope attachment, four sets of 10 reps. You don't wanna to go too heavy on this because you can hurt your shoulder because it's, it's a weird movement to get used to. And keeping a slight bend in your elbow will also help you with stability with this exercise. And then we did a hammer raise variation. Um, as you can see, I'm doing one rep in front, one rep behind. I did four sets of eight to 10 reps. Again, staying really, really light with this. Also a weird movement to get used to. And rear delt flies. I just did dumbbell holding on to something. Um, you wanna squeeze your shoulder blade together because this will get the back of your shoulder love this exercise do it almost every shoulder day please ignore becca being an idiot in this clip and for the last exercise i did do a little bit of chest i did chest fly on the cables um i do this pretty much every time i do chest um i really can feel the pump and i'm always super sore the next day and this uh, little movement I'm doing will help that inner chest split, I guess you could call it. And I just did a little bit of posing so you can see an updated physique. I'm very excited, I got my bikini in the mail. I love it, I'm not gonna show you until show day, but I will say it looks like a mermaid. That is all I'm giving you, that's it. Anyway, enjoy the rest of the vlog. Alrighty y'all, workout done. Going to Christina's dorm. I don't even know what the lighting looks like because I cannot see. I just got whistled at. Damn it. And I did legs two days ago. Christina's door. Cute. Cute. Christina! What up? Made me walk upstairs again. I thought we were done with these stupid okay, you stairs. Know what? In my defense, it's not as bad as it was in Decker. So. Real to the same length. You think so? To me, I did legs two days ago. <laughs> yeah, I'm eating. Tilapia rice and asparagus. Same as before, same as the past four weeks. Yeah, so I'm going to hang out here a little bit, and then go home, and I don't know what next, so catch you later. Alright, y'all. Well, I'm home. Um, I'm going to eat. I've got this meal, and then one more meal, and then I'll have my sweet potatoes, 
and they are light sweet potatoes. I'll show you. White sweet potatoes. Apparently they're the thing. Anyways, so that is my last meal. Later, it is 7.30 now, and then I'll eat at 9. 9 ish. And then, yeah. Uh, I have to dye my extensions, so I'm gonna eat and do that. And I think I'm gonna end the video here. Long day. Hope y'all enjoyed this workout. Um, let me know about the Acta leggings. I will leave my link and stuff in the description down below and my Blackstone Labs code in the description down below. So, I will see y'all in the next video. 12 days. Next video is peak week. Anyway, bye y'all.